I saw that her record was so good when I was recruiting her that it was a no-brainer to get her. And uh, then I'm always anxious to see how they play. And I'm sure, like all the other players, I want to see the first time I see him play on the court, because in the old days, we didn't really go and watch him play, and I didn't see her play before she came to Pepperdine, but her record was just too good to pass up. When I first met Angela was in 1999, January, and I was a transfer student, sophomore, and she was a senior, and I always think, I always thought of her as, as being a leader of the team. She was like a captain, and I loved everything about her, because she was in not only a great competitor, competitor, but also she was an amazing person and she really uh, made me feel welcome. Angela and I met during my junior year at Pepperdine. I remember that our tennis coach, Walberto Scudero, well, introduced her to the team and uh, I think he introduced her making some kind of joke because that's just how Wal was making a joke, but I remember I liked Angela from the first minute I met her. She just seemed like a happy person. And uh, I remember I, I liked all her, also her Australian accent. But Angela was very feisty and of course very competitive and she always wanted to win and that really brought the best of us. We were a top 10 team and she helped us to get better every day because of her. She was what we call a, an unorthodox player. I mean, she didn't play like all the other people or like the ones that the, the professionals really want them to, like you want to teach. She had her own way of playing, but what came through was her ability to, to compete and that made her be in the right place at the right time to make the appropriate shots. So, and she played like that all four years. She was always where she should be in position, and she made it look easy in her own way. You know, she just wasn't afraid of the moment or the opponent. She was going to take it to him, uh, no matter who it was. And a lot of times, the bigger the situation, the better she played. I always remember of Angela being such a good doubles player, and she was all over the net and had a great attitude, very energetic, always with a positive. Uh, mind and, and attitude and I really liked that about her and really brought the best on, on our team. Angela was my doubles partner so she she was a fighter on the court and she encouraged me to go for that extra shot, extra point and uh, I just remember we, we won a lot of matches together and we, we ended up top 10 the nation the two years that we played doubles together and thanks to Angela I got the All-American status. I mean success on the court um, to lead the team and have the team do as well and her being at the top spot and just how she carried herself on and off the court. She's just a real credit to the sport of tennis and Pepperdine. She just was uh, just one of those people you notice and someone who's just gonna shine through. Well, she cared about Pepperdine so much. She cared about our team. She wanted the best for us and for the coaches. And she had a great attitude. And uh, I remember that everybody liked her. She was very popular at Pepperdine. And the teachers, the, the student athletes. So she, she was great. I always have very, very good uh, memories of her. The funny stories, all I can think of is how gratifying it was to watch her play. And I mean that because I didn't really have to coach her much. Angela was always an overachiever and she deserved to be inducted into the Hall of Fame at Pepperdine because of all that. She did not only want to do well on court, but also off court. And she always strived to be the best at everything she did. Congratulations, Angela. You, uh, you deserve to be in the Hall of Fame and I'm just really happy that this moment is yours. Enjoy the night and get to relive all of your great uh, wave history. Angela, I am proud of you. I was happy to coach you because I didn't really have to coach you much. You're one of the smartest, quickest players I've seen. And, uh, but what makes me happiest is how proud you are of Pepperdine and how happy you are to show off Pepperdine to your family. Congratulations, Angela.